soil. It's what we stand on, what we grow our food in, and what often gets stuck in the treads of our shoes. But beyond these everyday encounters, soil is a living, breathing world, teeming with an astonishing diversity of life. At the heart of this hidden universe are the first trophic and photosynthetic bacteria, microscopic powerhouses that play a crucial role in maintaining soil health and by extension, life as we know it. These tiny architects of the soil are the unsung heroes of our planet, responsible for nutrient cycling, plant growth, and the very fabric of our ecosystems. Imagine a world teeming with more living organisms than there are stars in the Milky Way galaxy. Beneath our feet lies an unseen universe a hidden world that plays a crucial role in sustaining life on Earth. That's the soil microbiome, a complex and interconnected web of bacteria, fungi, protozoa, and other microscopic life forms. These tiny organisms work together in harmony, creating a balanced ecosystem that supports plant growth and health. This bustling metropolis beneath our feet is where the magic happens, where organic matter is broken down, nutrients are transformed, and the foundations of life are laid. Every piece of decaying leaf, every bit of plant matter is recycled and repurposed. The sheer diversity of the soil microbiome is staggering. With a single teaspoon of healthy soil containing billions of bacteria from thousands of different species, each microorganism plays a unique role, contributing to the overall health of the soil. It's like a crowded city, but instead of traffic jams, there's a constant exchange of nutrients, energy, and information. This dynamic environment ensures that plants receive the essential elements they need to thrive, creating a foundation for all terrestrial life. We all know about photosynthesis, the process by which plants use sunlight to convert carbon dioxide into energy. This remarkable process is what fuels the growth of plants, allowing them to produce the oxygen we breathe and the food we eat. But did you know that photosynthesis also happens underground? Yes, beneath our feet in the hidden layers of soil, a similar process is taking place. Cyanobacteria, those pioneers of the microbial world, are photosynthetic bacteria that can capture sunlight and convert it into energy, even in the depths. Microorganisms have been around for billions of years, playing a vital role in shaping our planet's atmosphere. These tiny green warriors are like the solar panels of the soil, providing energy for themselves and other organisms around them. They form the foundation of the soil food web, supporting a diverse range of life forms. And if that wasn't impressive enough, we also have chemoautotrophic bacteria. These bacteria are equally fascinating and essential to the ecosystem. These resourceful microbes don't need sunlight at all. Instead, they thrive in the dark, deep layers of the soil where sunlight cannot reach. They get their energy from inorganic compounds like nitrogen and sulfur, playing a crucial role in converting these elements into forms that plants can use. This process is essential for nutrient cycling and soil fertility. Talk about making the most of what you've got these incredible microorganisms ensure that life can thrive even in the most unexpected places, showcasing the resilience and adaptability of life on Earth. Nitrogen is like the protein shake of the plant world, essential for growth and development. Without it, plants would struggle to grow and their leaves would turn yellow and weak 
But here's the catch. Plants can't just pluck nitrogen from the air, even though it's the most abundant gas around. The nitrogen in the atmosphere is in a form that plants simply cannot use directly. Enter the nitrogen-fixing bacteria, a group of microbes with a knack for converting atmospheric nitrogen into a form that plants can use. These tiny organisms play a crucial role in the nitrogen cycle, transforming inert nitrogen gas into ammonia, which plants can readily absorb. One of the most remarkable examples of this is the symbiotic relationship between rhizobia bacteria and leguminous plants like beans, peas, and clover. This partnership is a natural marvel, showcasing the intricate connections in nature. These plants pergils in their roots, where rhizobia can, set up, rhizobia can set up shop, providing them with food and shelter in exchange for a steady supply of nitrogen. The nodules act as little homes for the bacteria, creating a perfect environment for them to thrive. It's a win-win situation, a bit like a plant micro roommate agreement, where everyone benefits. The plants get the nitrogen they need to grow strong and healthy, while the rhizobia bacteria receive carbohydrates and a safe place to live. Mycorrhizae, the fungal friends of plants. While we're on the topic of symbiotic relationships, let's not forget mycorrhizae, the fascinating partnerships between fungi and plant roots. These fungal friends extend their thread-like hyphae into the soil, acting like tiny root extensions that dramatically increase the plant's ability to absorb water and nutrients. In return, the fungi receive sugars produced by the plant through photosynthesis. It's like a plant delivery service, but instead of pizza, they're delivering essential nutrients. This ancient partnership is thought to have been crucial for plants colonizing land millions of years ago, highlighting the interconnectedness of life on Earth. The Decomposer's Nature's Recycling Crew. What happens to fallen leaves, dead plants, and other organic matter? They don't just pile up indefinitely, thankfully. That's where the decomposers come in a group of bacteria and fungi that break down organic matter into simpler compounds, releasing nutrients back into the soil. These microbial recyclers are the unsung heroes of the ecosystem, ensuring that nutrients are constantly cycled and made available for new life to flourish. Without them, the world would be a familiar place. Microbial diversity, a symphony of life in the soil. The soil microbiome is like a grand orchestra, with each group of microbes playing a crucial role in maintaining the harmony of the ecosystem. The greater the diversity of microbes, the more resilient and productive the soil. Diversity ensures that there are backup players for every role, ready to step in if conditions change. It's like having a diverse investment portfolio, spreading the risk and increasing the chances of success. Threats to the soil microbiome, a modern dilemma. Unfortunately, our modern agricultural practices often disrupt the delicate balance of the soil microbiome. Intensive tillage, synthetic fertilizers, and pesticides can decimate microbial populations, leaving the soil depleted and vulnerable. Imagine a bulldozer plowing through a rainforest. That's essentially what intensive tillage does to the soil ecosystem. It's time to rethink our relationship with the soil and embrace practices that nurture rather than destroy this vital resource. Restoring the balance, sustainable practices,
for a healthy soil future. The good news is that we can restore the health and vitality of our soils by embracing sustainable agricultural practices, reducing tillage, planting cover crops, and incorporating compost are just a few ways to promote microbial diversity and create a thriving soil ecosystem. It's about working with nature, not against it, to create a more sustainable and abundant future for all. Remember, healthy soil means healthy plants, healthy animals, and ultimately a healthier planet for us all.